Nation. Yo, what's going on? Wagwan is that guy. Get my dreads out for this dread review. Now, um, I watch a lot of shows with Missy on Netflix. One of the shows, even though it's not all on Netflix, but it's called Shameless. Shameless has been out for quite a while now, and this show is definitely very out of the ordinary, out of the norm. Throws you a lot of curveballs, and it really shows you life, how life is in Chicago. So I, I've really, really grown to loving this show. And one of the main characters does have dreads, Miss Shanola Hampton. Taking a quick look um, at her dreads, Shanola Hampton is an American actress best known for her role as Veronica Fisher on Showtime dramedy Shameless. She's born May 27, 1977, age 41, from New York, New York. New York, New York. Definitely suit her quite well. She's holding down the dread game. Really incredible for the women out there. Um, in this picture here, she actually has some kind of barrel rolled, barrel twisted back. Now, her dreads are very thin, very voluminous, very numerous. Um, some may even call them sister locks. Some might even call them sister locks. And uh, when you look at her locks in full effect, now. Yes, they're they're really nice. And now it actually does remind me of Cheska Lay, Cheska Locks, uh, quite a bit. She's kind of got the same structure, the same size going on, the same kind of hairstyles going on. Uh, the crinkly looks looks great on Shinola here, um, getting those braid outs happening. So her dreads are very curly. Uh, again here, she's got the braid out happening. Uh, braid outs are pretty easy to do. You just gotta braid your hair up into you know, braids for overnight, bring them out the next day, uh, and you got a crinkly effect. This one looks good because it's just the bottom half of her dreads that are crinkly, it's not the whole head. Uh, again here, another little updo with her locks, and um, this is kind of like before the letdown, before she let down her curls and her crinkles, this is kind of what it was looking like before. So she's very versatile and how she actually manages and maintains and displays her locks. Another updo happening here. Um, you know, with dreads, it's like, why bother wearing a hat when you can wear your hair? Uh, you know, in many different ways. So it's almost like having dreads is many different hats in one. Beautiful shot of her hair flowing in the wind. Now this shot shows just how voluminous, how skinny her locks actually are. So no, no word of doubt that she's actually getting these twisted every so often. And to have this many dreads, it's going to take a while to actually twist them all up. So Shinola's dreads looking real lit. Uh, definitely holding it down for the women out there. Um, I actually like that she doesn't wear her hair pulled back all the time. She does let it wear down and hang down. Uh, again here showing how she lets her hair hang down quite a bit. Uh, she still has the crinkly action going on. And also a lighter brown happening in her dreads as well. Uh, my guess is it's just from the sun. She doesn't look like she has any coloring or bleach in her hair. And here we can actually see the part going right down the middle of her head, which does in fact show some fresh twists that have been happening. So she's getting her hair retwisted right down to the scalp. Um, you can see the sun bleach, the sun kiss bleach in her hair. Um, fantastic. You know, very, very interesting looking locks from Shinola. You know, very inspire, inspiring. Um, these are little kind of locks that like Waka Flocka and Lil Wayne had back in the day that were super inspiring. So it's great to see her holding this look down. Uh, especially with these great updos that she's got going on. And if you, any of you guys are interested in learning these updos, um, I would say check out Je Cheska Locks Dreads. She's got a lot of tutorials on how to do 
uh, cool little flower petal hairstyles like this. This photo here being really detailed uh, and really showing it down to the scalp. Now she's got two dreads at the front of her head here. Um, I like to have more than just two there, maybe a third one in the middle. Everyone's different. But just note at how like almost perfection, how much perfection is in her locks. They look really nice. Uh, and here's a little bit of a throwback picture with her hair in an updo once again uh, with the shorter dreads. And lastly, just a little close up of her side bun that she's got going on. So again, very versatile in the way that she rocks her dreads. Let me know in the comment below what you think of Shinola's dreads and which hairstyle you like the best. But I'm going to end this video here. So peace out, one love. Thanks for watching. Stay happy and nappy. And I'll see you guys in the next dread review. Adios. Didn't you shine?